Did you know? Did you know? Did you know there was a party? And you were probably the only one not there. Coy Worthington of Melbourne Southeast decided to throw what is being called the best street party ever while his parents were away. 500 people showed up and it didn't get any better from there. The police were called in but they had to flee the scene because they were promptly greeted with projectiles from the party goers. They had injuries. Their cars had damages. They had to call in a police helicopter, a dog squad. The neighbor's cars had damages. And Mr. and Mrs. Worthington was slapped with a $20,000 fine. Corey Worthington, now on the interview circuit, has begun to answer some of the questions that's been on everyone's minds. While interviewing with ACA, which has become one of the most unapologetic apologies of the century, he was asked, has he spoken to his parents and what have they had to say about the situation? To which he replied, when they call, I don't answer, they would probably try to kill me. Later on in the interview, when the interviewer asked him would he like to remove his sunglasses so that he can apologize to his frightened neighbors and his parents, he said, I'll say sorry, but I'm not removing my glasses because they're famous. He's not kidding. In a radio show interview, he bolted from the room and down the fire escape when radio show host Matt Tilly tried to take off his sunglasses. Back to the ACA interview, when he was asked, does he help? plan to pay some of the $20,000, if not all of it, to which he responds, yeah, but I don't think I should have been fined because anybody random could have walked down the street and did it. Towards the end of the end of the ACA interview, the statement was made by the interviewer. We gotta go, but I suggest you take a very long, hard look at yourself, to which he replied, I did. Everyone has. They love it. Descriptions will be in the link, which should be over there. And if you don't know, now you know. Off the record, something about Corey says, actor, or I've seen him before. Maybe I've just watched too many surfer movies. Hmm. Wouldn't this be weird if it's like the biggest hoax of all time? Probably not, though, because a lot of people have covered it, I think. Anyway, if you don't know, now you know. Oh, and he said, I have, not I did.